My name is Jim Zoller. I'm going to read a poem called My Grandfather's Hand. By the end, he addressed envelopes from edge to edge at a forward slant precisely suited to the matronly schoolmistress who had disciplined his boyishness, who watched from over his shoulder like a predator his orphaned hand. The perfect loops and paralleled spikes of my grandfather's textbook cursive held for 80 years, growing large as if boldness were a remedy for failing eyes, a trembling pen, a dangerously erratic heart. He varied not a whit, even in the grip of his last illness, as if still to please her, whose stern attentions were as close as he might ever imagine to a mother's.